Welcome back everyone, this is more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So we're going to start this video out by using our skill points, we're just going to auto assign. And we're going to carry on. So we've got to speak to Akka, or Acha, whatever her name is. Uh, this way? I thought that they lived in that big building I was in. Oh god, gods. Speak to her. Archer, where is Hunwald? I tried to console him, but he pushed me away. I love the boy, I do. But I fear what would happen if he took his father's title. He's fragile and scattered. I saw him ride north, following the paved Roman road. To the old tall tree where he often passed time with his father, I imagine. You broke an oath to your ward. Hunwald loved you like family, and you lied to his face. In my way, I was trying to protect him. Oh, Saint Cuthbert, give me strength. Oaths and ale work better than your prayers and saints. Right, uh, this is a thousand meters away. Let's get rid of these two just for the Not fun of it. Off its perch. <laughs> <laughs> And we are gonna go to this tree, I guess. I mean, if it makes us pick between all the characters, I'm still gonna pick this Hunwald guy. Just because it's like, it feels like it's supposed to be the, uh, the actual way. I saw that donkey and I was confused. I thought it was a weird looking horse. Uh, I think I've gone the wrong way. Can I hop this wall? Yeah. There's the tree. It's the only one that's standing out more than anything. It doesn't look as generic as the others either. These woods, father. Oh, these <gasps> woods. <laughs> Eivor, what a pleasant surprise. Would you drink with me? Hunwald. Come, s sit, sit. Stay with me a while and contemplate... Contemplate... Contemplate the view. Pull yourself together. Collect yourself, Hunwald. There's many a man in Lincolnshire who'd pay to see your head on a pike. Well, they can wait a moment. Do not gorge on grief, nor give in to sadness. But let your aching love light the mead of your eyes and lead you to triumph. That is quite lovely. My father would have liked you. He liked all those who could swing a sword and speak a verse with ease. Hmm. I would have liked him too, I think. He had a large heart and a love for his people. I think I would have liked him too. <laughs> he and I used to wander up this way all the time. He would take me hunting. And I would catch the m most wretched little things if I caught anything at all. I was a rubbish hunter. <laughs> but he always said he was proud. Each and every time. A toast. Uh, to your father. To your father, Lord Hunbeorth. Of Lincolnshire. He may have dwindled from this world in death, but in life he was as stalwart as this tree. A wise old oak. Yes. Skull. Skull. <laughs> and then, and then my father says, it's the right goat, but it's the wrong end. 
<laughs> oh, my Swanborough loves that one. <laughs> she has a great sense of humour, my lady love. Father would have liked her. Right. Your Dane lady love, she sounds lovely. Too lovely to be real. You know what? We should visit her. We should go to Brimsky. Uh, gr Grimsby. Yes, yes, there's no time to lose. After you. Oh, God. Nothing like drinking and riding to jostle your troubles away. And the contents of your gut. Oh, really? Could he not just jump on my horse? Now come and enjoy the splendor of my shire. You Saxons and your tiny splendor. You have never seen mountains, have you? Or deep fjords like a giant's axe wound? Or towering falls that steam in the dead of winter? Snow sparkling like a blanket of jewels? That is splendor. Well, if your homeland is so splendor... ...full, why come to England at all? You cannot grow crops on a blanket of jewels. Ha! Ah, very true. I'll admit, your countryside does take the breath away. Quite so, quite so. I love this land. And should I follow my father's footsteps, I shall do my solemn duty to protect her. I know many think me foolish, inexperienced. But I would ask that they judge me by my future hopes, not my past reputation. If I am given sway over this land and show myself to be a poor leader, shame me, punish me, of course. But give me that chance. By God, I just want to have that chance. Well, that settles it. We'll give him it. Because by the sound of it, it's going to make us pick. What was that? Birds, Eivor! Has no one told them today is a day of grief? Shh! Quiet. Stop it. Hide or fight, Hunwald! Now! Father, give me strength to survive this. Come on. Ah! Eivor! Help! You're fine. Oh, you little shit. Devils! Who sent you? Speak or be damned! This bow is actually not too bad. I can't see. Climb up. How many of them is there? Oh, he got one shot. Leave him. Well struck, Eivor! I think I just shot him in the ass. That's twice they tried to kill you, Hunwald. And twice failed. We had luck, but if you're not more careful, they will succeed. Someone in Mercia wants you dead, and they'll kill anyone in the way to see it done. Yes, including my dear Swanborough, my lady love. Come, let us hurry away. I am serious, Hunwald. Are you hearing me? Plain and clear. Follow me. Where's my horse? Hunwald, are you sure this place is safe? The safest spot in the Shire, yes. Here I am with a chance to be Elderman, but I have yet to prove myself worthy. To you, to the Shire, to her. I can do nothing without my darling lady. You've made me realize how much I've neglected her through this fatal stupor of mine. This I must see for myself. It might be her that's trying to get him killed. It might be like an obsessive weirdo. Oh, are we having to walk? 
What about if I hop on my horse? Well, no, that's not mine. Oh, wait, hang on. Go on, hop on that horse. This is dope. Good old Grimsby. Come on, man. I wish you'd have jumped on the horse. I've got a feeling he was supposed to as well. Hundval! I thought for sure you'd be dead. Why didn't you send word? It has been far too long, my little jewel. I'm so very sorry for that. I'm fine, my love. I wilted without you, but still I grow. And who is this? Ah, yes. I am proud to present Eivor of the Raven Clan. Hello, Eivor. A pleasure to meet you. Good to meet you as well. And you, Swanborough. I wasn't sure what to make of Hunwald's stories, yet here you are. Surprised to find a Dane by his side? Not quite. I'm surprised to find a Saxon at yours. Hunwald seems to endear himself to all sorts. Eivor agreed to help me find my father. But I'm afraid it hasn't gone as well as I'd hoped. What's happened? My father is dead. Died of a cruel disease, apparently. Then shunted off to a cellar for burial. Oh my love, I'm sorry. And someone in your shire wants to make sure Hunwald follows his father to the grave. Let them try. I'll cut their throats. A shire mood will soon be held. Hunwald should stay here out of sight until he can attend. What if I left it all behind, my love? Forget my father's seat. What if I stayed here with you? Just the two of us. Hunwald, no. The Shire must be led with courage and heart. Follow in your father's footsteps and lead the Shire as he did. Listen to her. Whatever strength you lack, you have in Swanborough. Heed her advice. Yes. If anyone can lift my spirits in time for the Shire Moot, it's you, my dear. Come inside and rest your bumbling bones, love. Be well, Eivor, and thank you. Keep watch over that one. Men have come for him more than once. My blade will keep him safe. I do not doubt it. She sounds tougher than him. Well, we gotta go and see. What was his name? Alfgar. So I will see you there because it's 1400 meters away. Might even be quicker to fast travel. Probably. We'll go here. I knew it weren't gonna be as simple as just finding his dad. I just knew it. I was thinking, yeah, we just take him there, get it done, and I thought, no, nah, it's Assassin's Creed Valhalla. They like to make you do repetitive stuff. So, of course, it takes three videos to finish one quest. And this is why I don't enjoy this game. It, like, drags things out as much as it can. Eivor, I'm pleased you came. Welcome to my estate, old friend. Thane Alfgar. It's an impressive amount of land you oversee. Why, right. I often get lost swimming to my island in this flowing sea of wheat. You're quite a wealthy man, then. You're flush with land and crops, to be sure. You're a brave man to flaunt your riches from this lonely hill. 
It's not bravery, it's trust. I trust the respect I've earned keeps Saxon and Dane alike from temptation. You said you had something to show me when we last spoke. What did you mean? Uh, yes, I did. Observe. This fine specimen belonged to our beloved elderman, Hunbeort, before his untimely passing. He left it here when we last hunted together. I now wish you to have it. It's a nice weapon. It is a beautiful weapon, finely crafted. Thank you. I thought you might like it. Now, now, take it and come hither. I have a rousing hunt planned for the two of us. Leave aside talk of politics and shire moats. Let us enjoy the fruits of my land together. We're hunting or fruit picking? Both, if you like. Whatever you fancy. I'm generous with the yields of my estate, as you will see. To be plain, Eivor, a great bear has been badgering my estate for weeks. I must do away with it, if only to prevent a future tragedy. You brought me here to hunt a bear. Yes, and I'm so pleased you agreed to come. I suspect hey, you know better that? than most that I have what it takes to lead this shire. Though its line of kings is all but ended, the people of this land still teems with life, with promise. But today, the shire languishes. It needs the guidance of new blood. Like me. I'm sorry? I'm the definition of new blood. It may be I should put my name in for Elderman. <laughs> ah, there it is, that dark sense of humor. Blunt as a hammer, eh? Like the one carried by your, uh, uh, your thunder god. Uh, uh, I don't recall the name. Go on. What I mean to say is, I enjoy the company of your people. Or people like you. What little I've seen of them. And I don't care what stuffy fools like Herefriv and Hunwald say. You Danes are damned decent people. Not dense at all. Kind of you to notice. I remember when the Danes first arrived, not long ago. The locals were terrified, not of being raided, but of their spout. Are we hunting, Elvgar? Or is it your hope that I'll braid your hair? Hunting, definitely! The bear's lair should be nearby. Where are we looking? Ah! My old friend Grimm! How wonderful to see you here. What a pleasant surprise. What surprise? I came as you requested. Ah, uh, yes. And how is Grimsby? How are all the other Danes? I can't speak for all Danes, but I am well. And itching for a hunt, as you made plain in your message this morning. Yes, that's right. Very good. Uh, speaking of Danes, I'd like to introduce you to Eivor. Uh, perhaps you know each other as one Dane to another. Well met. It is good to meet you, Grim. Hey, Leivor. Did he lure you here as well with the promise of a hunt? He... Yes, hunting a bear! That's the point of all this. We're hunting, I promise. There's a cave just up the hill there. Seems a likely place for a lair. If the beast is as large as Elfgar claims, it'll take all three of us to bring it down. I'm game. Let's get a new fur cloak, shall we? Off There's all manner of now. beasts in this forest. If we don't find the bear, we'll find something worth our supper. I have a divine rule over the land on my estate. God shall provide. Where is this bear? Okay. Did I go the wrong way? I have a divine rule over the land on my estate. God oh, go. shall provide. Have no worry. Wait, what? Oh. That's not grim, though, is it? No. I'll guard. Eivor. There's something you'll want to see here. Is that... That smoke! My god! My estate is burning like a twig! Soon to be a sea of fire. Eivor! 
You're skilled enough, and I can't tell you how to handle this, but... Please! By God, help me with this! I'm in this fight with you! A clutch of puny Mercians don't frighten me! I've got a feeling he's like a setup. My people are fleeing! They must get to safety! Someone waited until you were away to set your world aflame. What? I should not be seen in this area. The marauding medicines! <laughs> Clear out the attackers, is that all? Apparently the chickens are in the Burn this! Stand on the down! Focus, we have this! Don't damn you! One more? Narsian dogs! Yeah, something seems set up about this. The men who would see you burn are dead. Let's get these fires out. Agreed. What a mess. A sea of ashes. I thank you, Eivor, for doing what you could. You're a man of many riches, Algar. You can rebuild. To be sure. But I do not look forward to the toilet. <laughs> Sweet Lord in heaven! The bear is returned! The Shiremood will start soon. I should return to Lincoln to see that it Listen, goes well. Killing the bear. <laughs> The Shiremood will start soon. I should return to Lincoln to see that it goes well. Alright, on we go then. We'll try and get this done because I think this is the last bit. Hopefully it's the last bit anyway. Of this quest, obviously. For a low-level quest, this is long. Can't speak to her. Archer, is everything ready? The Shiremoot will soon begin. Will you join us, Eivor? We'd be comforted by your presence. Yeah, let's attend. Yes, I'm curious to see this Shiremoot for myself. I will follow. When will the vote begin, Abbas? Twelve able lords of Lincolnshire have already cast their stones. But they have reached a tie. Four votes for each man. It now falls to you to break this impasse. Me? By whose order? You have earned the trust of our three candidates, it seems. Even our bishop has found a certain fondness for your hardy spirit. Uh, my decision... No. How do you counsel the vote? It's an important vote for your people. How would you counsel my vote? I value competent and righteous leadership, not foolish friends in high seats. Anyone but Hunwald, you mean? I love Hunwald, as I love my own kin. But I would not put a stone in his care without fearing for the safety of both. I pray that God guides your vote today, and not the devil, as I fear. Uh, I don't need to speak to the council. A vote for Hunwald will return the house of the ferocious swan to its former glory. Free men, free possible futures. Which of these sad puppets will dance best when you call upon them? It is not for myself I must cast the stone. But for my clan, who will serve us best in a time of true need? You can never be certain where you stand in another's heart. Choose only for yourself. All three have strengths and weaknesses. 
Uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna go Hunwald. Hunwald is not the most cunning or clever, but he has heart and spirit. Both go a long way in times of need. I cast my vote for Hunwald. Lead your shire with pride, ferocious swan. It is decreed by this lawful Shire moot that the Elderman of Lincolnshire shall be son of our dear and departed Lord Hundbjorn, Lord Hunwald of Lincolnshire. I... I don't know what to say. I thank you. Deeply, madly, humbly. What more can I say? I... I don't know. I miss my father. I'd sooner see him standing here than... Well, I will do my best. For each and every one of you. Let us all raise our cups. A toast to our new elderman. As all well know, this Shiremoot's decision is not final, but advisory. It now falls to our newly anointed King Cheowulf to ratify our choice. To this end, we need not worry. Cheowulf is a friend to Saxon and Dane alike, and he is sure to approve the results. Our good and noble friend, Arvelswith. A septic rot has overtaken this shire. A sickness for which there is only one cure. Your grace! What is this? Nobles of Lincolnshire, stand fast! For the glory of the ancients, leave none alive! So he's a bad guy. Mother of God! Another battle! Hold steady, Elderman! That's it, that is, man. God deliver us from all evil! Men of Lincolnshire, stand firm! Defend your Elderman! Kill these traitors! I wish there were more variants. Is this events. how their guard welcomes a new elderman? Bastard bishop. What's his endgame? This one's gone. Find those who still draw breath. Polish your ass, Hunwald. The Elderman's seat is yours. As your war council, I suggest you waste no time in catching this grief tosser. He won't be far. We should first bury our dead, no? That choice is yours to make, Elderman. Yes. Yes, of course. We'll bury our dead, then raise a feared. I am at a loss for words. A trusted man of the cloth. <coughs> I will pray for these martyrs and tend to the remaining wounded until the last man walks free. Be well, Archer. And you, Eivor. 
May God or... or the gods protect you. I knew, I knew one of them was going to be a bad guy. I didn't expect it to be the priest to begin with. I thought it was going to be the other guy. So this video has gone on quite long as it is. I did want to finish this like quest line. It's just, it's just way too long. I don't know. Speak to the new elderman, I guess. I guess we're just going to do it. Might be a bit long, but it's only the editing that puts me off. I don't mind doing it. Just to get this out of the way. Get it done in at least three parts. Here we go. Speak to the new elderman. I assume that's this group of people over here. Or one of them, at least. And hopefully we get to kill that bishop guy. And in broad daylight. What news, Hunwald? We've learned that Herevrith rode for the fort at Anicastri following the massacre. I have assembled a fiat there. Quite a large one, in fact. They eagerly await your orders, Eivor. You mean your orders, Elderman? Ah, yes, that's right. My orders. Which are... Which are what, exactly? Who can say? Ride with me to your camp and we'll find out together. Oh, this is not going to be long. Herevrith was a friend of my father. Others and always so dear to me. I don't understand what possessed him. He invoked the name of an ancient order before his men attacked. I know exactly what possessed him. Do you? It's not a story for now. This will send waves of disgust through all the parishes of Mercia. Herifrith is a new and ugly stain on the bishopric. Your Christ was an interesting man, if a little soft. But stranger still, I've met so few Christians like him. Today has been a boon, Eivor. In spite of everything, I now know my father's spirit still burns within me. It's thanks to you I know this. When songs are sung of the day Lincolnshire was saved, your name will ripple through every stanza. Don't be hasty, Hunwald. One verse of our song remains unsung. The din of battle beckons. You pagans and your appetite for battle. I certainly don't share it. I worry what diabolical feast the bishop has in store. Don't let that poxy bishop worry you. With Eivor beside us, he'll be victuals before long. How has Acha taken all this? She and Herevrith were so close. She must feel as though the devil himself attacked her monastery. A poor lady. We spoke briefly. Her spirits were we low. We are but... the men of Lincolnshire! Remember it! Manipulated by a man who should be... Here's the camp, do you see? The feared will soon be ready for action. Our warsmith has arrived. The feards are ready to fight. Chieftain Eivor, can we win this fight with the men you see assembled here? If they fight with the bravery of double their number, we may. And is there room in your Valhalla for a ferocious swan? Of course. Let fly your glorious banner. Are we ready then? Let's go. We attack now. Ready the fiat. Our first task will be to breach the outer wall. Then we deal with the troops inside. Here's the... Mm. <sighs> yeah, it's just another one of those like raids where you go in. I usually hop over the walls, destroy the gates. <laughs> Here we go. Should only take me a couple of minutes. To me, Let's holy go. warriors of Lincolnshire. The best way to breach is with a battering ram. I should help it along. No, the best way to breach is to go over the wall. It's supposed to be Assassin's Creed. Get back here and face me! Try to fight! Remain steadfast! I'm good. Oil! Come on in. Next one. Damn you! You're mine! Fight, men! Fight a 
that so guy you'll really tall. hang from your mouth. The guy that's been running from the right to the left. Need to find a way past that palisade. An explosion could do it. Or I can try oh, hitting it with a spring bolt. <laughs> Uh, can I use that? No. Grab this. Because obviously this explosion is different. And this guy's on this side of the wall already. There we go. Next one. Yeah, this really doesn't take long at all. Up here. Gotta break the uh Hunwald, watch your arse! The locks I, I got mechanisms on the thanks, Alpha! Thank me with a bleeding dog! Gods! Herafrith has gone mad! You point me to the bishop. No one else need die today. He he's he's in the chapel there. Hiding away. Scabrous coward. Let no one leave that church without facing judgment. I guess we got a climb on. Sort of obvious there. The respite, Lord, please. Our battle is lost. Continue the work of God, my boy. Kill this pagan! We come in order each day. That was easy. I died the day I hid behind these robes, this cross. To bring the light of my order to a wider view, I debased myself. Clawed my way to the top of this common religion, full of common men. I should have lived as the ancients did. That's the folly of mankind, Herifrith. We wallow in our failures, like happy pigs in a sty of shit. You should have learned to enjoy it. Shit! Never saw again! That was really ah! short. We're done. It took me like two and a half, three minutes. Where are you, Hunwald? Apparently, he's up. Up where? Uh. I don't understand. Oh, up here. I was miles away. Let's finish this up and finish this video up. I like the fact that it's daytime too. Eivor, is he... Is the bishop dead? He bled too little and talked too much. Now he's gone. I won't miss him. But Atcha will need some time to grieve. You fought well. You fought well, ferocious swan. Notched a few scars in your baby fat today. Yes, but they will heal. And stronger than before. Lincolnshire is yours to lead, Elderman. The hardest fight begins now. The din of battle still rings in my ears. I think I now know what it means to be a leader. Good. I would ask a favor, if I could. Name it. As Elderman, my life may be a dangerous one. For a time, anyway. Would you allow my Swanborough to take refuge in your settlement? At least until I feel all danger has passed. We'd be happy to have her. 
Thank you, my sturdy Norse berserker. The mead halls of my shire will be lonely without you stomping about. Our people are bonded now. We must look out for one another. Blast it. I am a horror with goodbyes. It'll do for now. N now it seems the wind calls me back to Ranvi. Best tell her the good news. And um, we are done. So, to not make this video any longer, thank you for watching. Until next time, bye bye.